morning, it's Hannah and welcome back to my channel. So today I will be showing you guys what I usually eat in a day. It really depends on what I have in the kitchen or in the fridge that day. And I usually have two or three meals a day, but today I'm gonna show you guys three meals. I don't really strict myself about food. Uh, yeah, so let's jump into it. First, we're gonna make some breakfast and I'm gonna show you guys right now. Alright, so today I'm going to make some pancakes. It's called Sinfit. They have really high protein, corn free and zero fat. It's really simple to make. It's just mix uh, this mixer with uh, cold water. Put one half cup in here. And mix it up. smell really good already guys with the chocolate flavor okay so I'm gonna use this pan and just place the pancake on that's it simple Put some uh, frozen uh, strawberry. And strawberry on top, and some blueberries as well. I really like blueberries. I don't know you guys, but you know everything with blueberry just looks so good. So this is the blueberry flavor syrup. It's with pancakes right here, and the good thing about this one is it has no calories, which is really good. I really like maple syrup, so I'm gonna put a lot on it. <laughs> Alright, so breakfast is served. Looks really pretty. Chocolate pancakes and fruit. Let's give it a try. First bite. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, the frozen fruit is really good. Like, like the ice cream. It tastes like ice cream. It's really good. <laughs> it is lunch time, and today <laughs> you smell good. All right, guys. It is lunch time, and I'm having some uh, hot chicken ramen flavor, flavor ramen, and this is really spicy. If you are a fan of Korean food, you probably know what it is because it is really popular. I eat like two or three times a week and I become as addicted to this. It's just really hot, really tasty, it's, tasty, it's really good, but it's really hot, I'm not gonna lie. I usually eat this with uh, one fried egg. Let's cook this baby. So the water is boiling right now. I'm gonna put the ramen in here and cooked for three minutes or so. I usually uh, do not break this because I don't want to just have the long ramen when I eat. It's easier to eat. So I just break them to four. Tell me, what do you use to eat noodles? Your fork or noodles? I mean... <laughs> you use the noodles to eat the noodles? <laughs> fork or chopstick? <laughs> Fork. Fork is easier with fork. So while I'm waiting this one to cook, I'm gonna fry some egg. So I'm gonna spray a little bit of oil in here. It's a sauce. The deadly sauce. <laughs> I'm gonna pour over the noodles. Uh, seaweed. Seaweed, yeah. Nori and sesame seeds. Sesame seeds, yeah. Just to make it through. Just on top of like this. Yeah. Lunch is done. All right. Let's give it a try. It's really, really spicy. Okay. You want some? No. Mm. It tastes really good. 
fantastic spicy of course my favorite part <coughs> you okay it is really spicy it's hot sweating but it feels really good last bite oh my god I'm sorry I'm sweating spicy Last bite. For today dinner, I have some chicken breast. Give them a little bit. Feel cut. Just make sure it's uh, cooked inside as well. I'm gonna put a little bit uh, salt. A little pepper. I'm gonna let them sift. I think probably uh, five minutes. Alright, so dinner is served. I had a lot of carbs in uh, breakfast and lunch, so in dinner I don't want to have any carbs anymore. So let's give it a try. The chicken is really chewy, it's not dry. Where's my. Mm hmm. Mmm. That's really, really good. Chicken breast is dry enough for me, so you know, I always try my best to make it, you know, not as dry as possible. But yeah, the chicken today is really good. It's not dry, which is. I like. Mm -hmm.